What's up, YouTube? Lance the Southern Illinois Piper here on a Sunday, I do believe. Smoking my Joby Tortoise Poker. I like this pipe, it's real nice. Got a good grain on it, <clears throat> nice stem. That's a good little smoker. And in it, what I'm smoking is the reason for me making this video. And before I go any further, I know a lot of people's a lot of, by watching my videos, what subscribers I have probably thinking this guy does nothing but review Strauss tobacco. Listen, I'm one of those if I latch on the if I find a company, I try out different varieties of their blends, and if I like them, I review about them. So far, every one that I've tried from Strauss has been awesome. So. Maybe it's just me and my personal taste, but if you get a chance to order from them and get a sheet of their aromatics, their Englishes, it's very, very worth the money and worth your time. I'm reviewing, <coughs> they abbreviated it, but it's Dead Man's Chest. And it's an aromatic. I love this stuff. They got here on the sheet. It's a unique blend of flavored black pressed ribbon cut Virginia and burley, punctuated with rum and vanilla and a hint of caramel. And I've had this before. This is my second. Well, it's my second half pound of it, but I'll just you know, it's my own problem. But. The difference in the first batch, I could tell the car, the caramel real good. This batch here, I get a little bit more of the rum taste, but it's still all good. Um, it's got a really good taste to it. I mean, I like it. I like it a lot. It's good with a cup of coffee, or even in my case, RC, or even a glass of whiskey. You just, you know, it's, it's just a real good aromatic. I've had a pretty good week, a weekend. I've worked the majority of it. I got some videos posted that I hadn't got posted in a while. I hadn't made a while back. I just never got around to posting them. And also, too, shout out to the Smoking Dagners in the lane. They gave me a shout out on their video. They like to pack. I hope they like their package. I know Jason said he really did like the Dead Man's Chest, which was good. I mean, some of the tobaccos, I know, it's weird with these Strauss tobaccos, they're aromatics. If you're a person that don't like aromatics, and you try a Strauss aromatic, immediately it changes your mind, because it dispels the myth of arrows. I mean, everyone that I've had, I have literally not had... Any tongue bite from it, I've never, I've not had it taste, you know, the chemically crappy taste you get when you get through half a bowl, uh, a dry smoke. I mean, my, I mean, I've smoked the crap out of one of those dead man's chest, and my, on my bowl didn't get real goopy or nothing. It was kind of dry, other than the, other than my own saliva, but other than that, it's just really good stuff. I got another one from Strauss that I'll make a video on after I've smoked a bowl of it. And this, for all you Balkan lovers out there, it's called Balkan Supreme. And it's one of, I guess, the take on it was, where you at? Because I've already smoked it, it's real good. It, won, it was named Best English 2014 at the Chicagoland Pipe Show. So that's what had me hooked. I mean, I like the Balkan Sobrani and the Balkan Blue or Blue Mountain, whatever you want, whatever rendition you have in your cellar. And uh, I thought I'd give this a shot. And I was literally first bowl, I was blown away by it. But I'll go into more further detail in another video. Um, I 
I was just I was watching some YouTube videos. Uh, smoking Grandpa Bones. He's up north of me. He's up in around Aurora. I'm down south, closer to the Ohio River. It's cold here, and we've had rain. You know, not really freezing rain, but it's been pretty cold down south here. And looks like we're going to get even colder by Wednesday. They're talking we're going to have zero, probably with a wind chill in the negatives. Which will make for a fun, fun time going back and forth to work. Because where I work at, I'm a butcher. I work in a, in a back in a cooler, basically. The meat shop I work in and the local grocery store is cold. And they always joke with me that you never hear Lance gripe about it being too cold, but you know, he'll be the first one to gripe when it gets too hot. Which sometimes is the truth, but right now it's going, it was, today it was getting cold. They're at work, but by say by Wednesday I'll be squalling. I'm just, of course, there's probably people out there that work outside in it every day and probably are laughing their butts off at me, but, you know, can't help it. It's just how I'm used to. But no, um, I ain't got no really other exciting information to share. No. I just, I'm glad the daggers like the package I sent them. I hope, uh, oh yeah, Jason, I forgot to tell you, on the 829 cigars, if you cut them with a guillotine cutter, the wrappers do get kind of loose. So, just thought I'd let you know that little tidbit. I should have probably wrote that in the note. And, uh, for uh, Jay, send me a message, message me on Instagram and let me know how you liked, or whenever you do a video, if you're smoking it, let me know how you like the Colt Blood Red Moon. It's good stuff. That's why I didn't know you had never heard of it, which is great. I love introducing people to new tobaccos. But I'm going to sit here and enjoy this, sit in my RC and take it easy, and then it won't be long. It'll be time for me to hit the bed. So, uh, until next time, this is Lance the Southern Illinois Piper. Sweet smokes.